So, first video was out. Some of you might be, uh, might have browsed the channel a little bit. I got about, I think I have four videos on there, something like that. You'll notice that, uh, I have a couple World of Warcraft videos. Don't worry. It is not a World of Warcraft channel. I promise. I just happen to have one video with like 26,000 views of how to do something extremely basic that everybody should know that plays the game. But for some reason, 26,000 people just didn't know. I'm just out of my place. Really just browsing around. Surveying the, uh, I guess we can call it the winter damage of leaves everywhere. This is just the front yard. I'll probably work on cleaning this up here starting at some point. You never know. It'll, it'll take a little bit of work. Got some wood here. But, at least get the front looking good. And go around back. Work on that. Maybe do a little bit of work on this, these garage windows here. And uh, see if we can get some insulation in them for the winter because it kills, our, it kills the electric bill out here. So, according to... Uh, my grandmother, who's the one that actually pays the electric bill. But, uh... Kind of just want to help out around here a little bit. I mean, it's providing me a place to sleep and charge the phone so I can record these videos, right? Work on it. A uh, little bit of a split there in the foundation. I don't know if that'll be an issue or not. But... I'll probably talk to somebody about it, see if it'll be an issue. Got our spigot there for, a, for a, a hose that used to be there at some point. Our, uh, it's a little loose. Our bolts are coming out. Really, I think those are just screws stuck into the concrete. Could probably get that corrected. But I haven't actually gotten around to mowing the yard yet simply because it doesn't look like it really needed done. It sure does look a little patchy. But I'm not going to get to it today because, like I said, it's been it's fairly muddy out. And I haven't actually gotten around to working on the lawnmower yet to see if the lawnmower is wanting to work. But I'm mostly just pacing around the yard, surveying. We had a fence that was here at one point. You can probably still see the post sticking up out of the ground. We tore some of it out last year. Probably gonna work on that a little bit more today. Ooh, it's about seven o'clock, so the sun's right there in my eyes. You guys can see my face quite clearly. But, I want to clean this place up a little bit. So we've got mud all over the ground. Here's where we uh, threw the fence. At least for now. Need to find somewhere to put that. Burn, probably burn the branches off and scrap it. Got this hot tub that's been sitting here for a while don't know if it's still good but that's a future project to work on yeah leaves everywhere because this house is surrounded by a bunch of trees Of 
course, we got a tree growing down here in our ditch. Apparently it has been growing for a while. No worries, this isn't a second tree. This is actually just a branch that fell off of that one up there. So we're working through it. All of this down to probably about that shed down there is probably our land. It'll be a bit of a project. But uh, those are my summer plans. I don't know exactly what I'm going to start working on. But the plan is, for now, eventually. You know, try to work some of this off of here. But we did actually fix the truck. The headlight is back in solid. And uh, got my grill back on. This is the headlight that was busted out. Pretty solid in there. Won't go anywhere now. It works. Hood is still the wrong color. That's uh, probably never going to get fixed because I don't really care. This driveway, it works. It, it gets to be a little bit of a pain in the mornings when I take off way early in the morning for work and the other residents of the household tend to get stuck in the driveway because in the winter time I don't get around to... Oh, that was a ping on Facebook. We'll ignore that for now. But, it tends to get stuck right about here in the driveway where uh, they can't get the vehicles up through here because first thing that happens is that this driveway ice is over really fast. I need to figure out if there's any way I can work that out and make, make sure it doesn't happen next winter because I honestly don't like getting vehicles unstuck when they're on a hill covered with ice. That's a pretty steep hill about the middle of the driveway. I'd say somewhere around a 40 degree angle, something like that, at the uh, steepest. So, really do want to see if there's anything I can do about that myself. Preferably on the cheap because I don't make a huge amount of spare money to be able to do that. But those are generally my rough plans for the summer here is actually get around to actually cleaning up this place. Got some. I think these used to be like vegetable garden cages, but they're all beat up and somebody just tucked them right there. Don't ask me. Basically, uh. I'm going to use this video series I'm making here to actually just motivate myself into actually doing something. And, uh, clean myself up a little bit. I'm missing quite a bit of hair, after all. Oh yeah, and, uh, I need to fix that gutter. I'll see if I can do something about it as soon as I locate a ladder. Actually, maybe there was one over here. Did I see one? Did you see one? No, not there. I'll find one. Don't worry. I just want one that'll reach up probably this side of the house. Which, if we don't have one here... I can find it, but to my understanding, this whole gutter system fell down in a, la in a windstorm over winter, so I don't know if we can use the existing gutter, or if we can use the, uh, or if we have to get a new one. I mean, 
gutters are really just aluminum, so maybe I can just bend it back in shape and nail it up there. Actually, why would I even nail it? I'd rather just use screws. But it looks like they had a big long bolt that went through them. And that held both sides of the gutter upright. Obviously, if it rains anything serious, our gutter system is not going to channel the water properly. That and with all these trees around, our the gutters are probably packed full of leaves anyway, so we need to work that out. Which, to prevent that, I got a whole fence on the opposite side of the house I could use. Ooh. Make it so that the leaves land on top of the fence, maybe? I don't know, let's go back to that fence. Take a look. Oh yeah, and uh... The trees are uh, wrapped up in dog chain because there used to be a dog here too. Not anymore. So we can correct that. Get these dog chains out of here. Let's see. Fence, 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 fence. Okay. Let's see. This is the fence, as it is. These don't fall through it particularly well. So I'm thinking, this is just immediately off my head. We could use this somehow and really just recycle it. That's the idea. I don't know, what do you guys think? We'll get working out. Oh, hey! Found a ladder. I don't know if I really want to use that one. But, that one's been found. Oh, yeah. This apparently was a fancy hot tub at one point, it's got a set of stairs. We can try it. Probably have to see if we can build something for it. Maybe uh, build a little shed right here for it and tuck it inside there. And it's been sitting on these cinder blocks here for a while. So we could probably make a foundation for it. I'll adjust those. That's worth. That's probably something worth talking about. That could actually be built pretty cheaply. Just make a wood frame going up out of just a hot tub, and set up like just a screen so we can get a nice view of the outdoors and be exposed to the environment, and then. Maybe have something like a canvas that we can have dropped out. I have to sketch that up. That's an idea. Because uh, we do want to cover the hot tub so it doesn't get packed full of uh, leaves, leaves, and more leaves. It's basically just a tub full of leaves and more leaves. But, it's going to take a bit of scrubbing to make work, but it looks doable. I might not, this is probably going to be the last thing I work on, because I want to get the place cleaned up around it first. It's an experiment. There's also... No water spigot on this side of the house that I see. I don't think there is one. Not over here. 
Uh, cause we got an air conditioning unit that's currently wrapped up in a bunch of cat food bags. Our cable and I think those are just cable connections. Don't quote me on that. That's something I need to investigate by going up into the attic. I would just put the hot tub right here, right out the door. I don't know, we've already got these steps here though, so maybe maybe that won't work, but we just put it and use the door right beside it. These are all doors, they're not solid windows at all. So we can we can do we can build off of that quite a bit if we really wanted to. I mean, there's already a giant porch right here. A whole porch system and probably what what I personally like to refer to as a half courtyard. We've got one deck, two decks, and another deck right there in front of the technically speaking back door. One thing I'm not really looking forward to is raking all the leaves. Not really something I want to be doing by myself. I don't even know what to, what to do with the leaves anymore. Apparently in the state of Ohio we're not allowed to burn them. Not until September. So I guess we just throw them in the trash. I guess. Also, one thing I really enjoy about this place is you just sit outside and you just hear birds singing. But this is the family home. I know my sister is helping my grandmother help up clean up on the inside. So I might as well try to help clean up the outside. I don't know. Uh, I do have an issue with that, though. I can't do too much because I was born with a foot condition. You. So what you're gonna see happen is I might not really get that much done. See, I was born club-footed, so in both my feet. Basically, how it worked out was that. My foot was uh, bent, I think, if I remember right, it was bent in, or both my feet were. In fact, according to my dad, I was almost named JJ rather than Josh. But what happens is that right here in front of my ankles, I've already had the, corrected, the first corrective surgery, so I don't need to worry about that. But I do have post surgery surgery things to work with because I'll, this surgery was performed while I was still a baby but nowadays I just have an overgrown bone right here in front of each each of my ankles and after a long day of work I tend to get my feet both tend to get swollen up quite bad Making it so that I can't really walk too well. So, so camera's on this this side, so I need to stop holding my phone on that side. Which I think the microphone is actually on this side over here. Hey, maybe it's time to actually get a proper camera. But anyway, uh, that's my big issue with this outdoor project work it could be an issue but if I stick it to just weekends I might be able to get enough work done to look passable to an extent but I do know that my grandmother contracts with a landscaper to at least mow the yard I believe it's at least mowing the yard I'd have to double check 
so you can do that. I'll generally work through everything else and start with this staircase because I'm tired of clearing these leaves out every time I walk down the steps because they always come back. What do you guys think?